Hello guys, welcome to today's night routine. Before I get into this evening, I want to thank AG1 for sponsoring today's video. Since I didn't film earlier this night, I'm going to show you guys me prepping my AG1 morning drink. You all already know that I prioritize my health by taking formulations such as ones that support immunity. Now if you don't already know, AG1 is a science-driven formulation supplement that supports the whole body health. It's a formulation of micronutrients, phytonutrients, and essential symbiotics. It's packed with 75 vitamins, minerals, probiotics, and whole food source ingredients that supports our brain, gut, and immune system. They source the best and highest quality ingredients it can find. It's gluten and dairy-free, vegan, keto, and only one gram of naturally occurring sugar per serving. Just one. By preparing this first thing in the morning, it fits perfectly with my wellness routine since I'm always trying to consume anything that replenishes my daily nutrients. It's simple and easy to commit to this type of nutritional habit day in and day out. Let me tell you guys something. 2024 is right around the corner, and I know that's scary to hear. When setting any type of intentions in your life, consistency is key for anything. AG1 can be an essential part of a routine because it's a daily habit. So it also helps create consistency in your health routine. We're currently in the middle of the holidays and AG1 is supporting me during this holiday season by maintaining my health, managing my stress along with supporting my digestive health and my immune system. I've had AG1 a part of my routine for a long time now. I've been trying to remember to prepare it here and there. Even when I slack, whenever I do manage to be consistent with it, I always feel better after consuming it, like no lie. Such as having a boost in my focus and a boost in my energy, so I do need a little less coffee. And that's a plus, because I do know that coffee increases anxiety, even though it tastes amazing. It reduces my bloating and cravings, gone. Ironically, I am on my period today. <laughs> Stress doesn't bother me as much, and I feel 10 times better after a workout. Now, let me go in detail and tell you guys the benefits of AG1. Now, focus and energy. Skip the sugary holiday drinks and reach for an AG1 instead. It's filled with high quality quality ingredients like radiola, magnesium, and B vitamins. AG1 works to support sustained energy for even the most exhausting holiday stress, which brings me to my next benefit, stress and mood balance. From powerful plant extracts, adaptogenic herbs, and antioxidants to help support your metabolism and promote mental clarity, alertness, and better focus. It's got like that fruity aftertaste. If you guys want to get started on scooping AG1 into your daily routine, you guys can save $20 when you subscribe to the link on the screen or you can click in the description. AG1 is also going to give my community a free one-year supply of AG Vitamins D3 plus K2 and five AG1 travel packs with your first purchase. Thanks to AG1 for sponsoring today's video. Hello guys. Sadly, I'm going to have to say it. This may or may not be my last Vlogmas until Christmas just because I think we all have to realize Christmas is around the corner. I'm doing Vlogmas on TikTok and on YouTube, so I'm like trying my best to film as many days as I can and get some editing days in and then also trying to Christmas shop last minute. It's a hassle, but we got the content of this year. We did it on both platforms, so hopefully everybody's happy and all that. I am really proud of myself for Vlogmas this year. Let's just cheers for the final Vlogmas day and today's going to be a night routine. Today's going to be a cozy little night routine. It is currently Wednesday. I, I woke up at 4 a.m. today like accidentally barely got any sleep last night I fell asleep at like 10 yesterday woke up at 5 a.m. as well So I woke up at 4 a.m. So I barely got sleep, but yeah, I'm energized felt like making some gingerbread cookies today And that's what we did. It's gonna be chilling in the fridge for two hours or three So I did that first thing once I got back from my walk We went grocery shopping today maintenance came and painted the walls We had a lot of scruff marks on the walls and we also installed I don't know if you can see we installed the TV, but we finally mounted it Mounted it is that the right now a verb adjective we we mounted it and I'll show you guys that in a minute but we also put up the LED lights and I think my living situation has completely changed like the ambiance is 10 times better it's 551 this is technically night because ever since daylight savings <coughs> Ever since daylight savings, the sun is no more after 5 p.m. At 5.30, the sun is gone. I will shamefully say that I did go to the gym this morning and I have not showered since then. I had to go grocery shopping, running around, had to go get last minute Christmas gifts. And I will say I am very dirty right now. So, oh, let me show you the gifts so far. Look at this, just like three bags here. We just gifted my maintenance guy a basket. I'll show it on the screen. But we just gifted him a cute little basket. We gave we gifted him a champagne and chocolate last year. And we barely knew him, but he's been coming around a lot recently lately. So we just really went all out with the, his little bird basket. And he has kids, so we like added some things there for his kids. But here is a gift from my dad. It has like four gifts in here. I wrapped them all up. I have one, two, three, four in there. Madre's gift. She also has like four gifts in there that I wrapped up. And then and my brother-in-law's gift, which was very last minute because I completely forgot that 
he's still living here. And my sister, she's currently not in the state right now, so I didn't get her anything. So many times that I gifted myself for Christmas, and like, this is a gift for me, but I didn't do that this year. Oh my God, wanna humble me. But I, I, gift, I gift myself with everything, everything, everything around my house. I can't speak too, but I can't say like red leather, yellow leather. I know people have to practice that to like voice act for like cartoons and whatever, but I cannot do that. Red leather, red, I promise you, I don't purposely talk dumb. I swear. I just, I think there's something. It has to be the tongue piercing. I just don't know how to speak. I, I, I don't know. Red leather, yellow leather. Red leather, red leather, yellow leather. Red leather, yellow leather. Red leather, yellow leather. Red leather, yellow leather. I'm supposed to be prepping the salsa. I already made dinner yesterday, so there's no cooking tonight. We're just gonna warm up leftovers. It's just some spaghetti and ground meat, uh, meat sauce. So all I gotta do is warm that up. There's no cooking involved. However, I was in the mood for some chips and dip. My famous salsa that everybody loves every time I make it is like homemade. It's like chopped, but it takes me an hour to do. So time's a ticking. When it's five o'clock, like time goes very fast. Can we just talk about how different the apartment feels when I have a TV and not a projector. We still have the projector. We're going to leave it in the bedroom, but I can play games here and then Matt could play games in the other room we can play. We might do that tonight, either a movie or we're gonna play games tonight. It really depends on how tired we are, but it's mounted. We got the LED lights up and it just, I don't know. The ambiance, it's so much different here. And then we got our little fire pit, our false fire pit with some battery light candles, which makes it so cute down there. I really wanna invest in a fire pit one day, but this is what I'm gonna work with. I'm gonna make the pico real quick. Equivocally busting as always. This is our leftovers. And I'm gonna be warming up. I'm gonna add some chicken stock to give it some liquid. I just like my pasta liquidy, so I'm gonna take a shower while this is warming up. My hair is freshly washed. I don't need to wash it today. I have not have kept my eyebrows glued on after I've washed my face. Just finished dinner. I'm already getting tired. As I said, like I woke up at five this morning. Woke up early yesterday morning at five. Woke up this morning at four actually. Barely got sleep last night. So. But I gotta make these gingerbread cookies. They have been in the fridge for over three hours, I think. We're going to lay it out. We're gonna cut our little gingerbread man's shapes. And then while they're baking, we're gonna watch a movie and have some tea. Very cozy night routine.
Oh. We're ending off the night with our sleep gummies that I got off of Amazon. Recommended on TikTok, guys. For the first like five times I tried this, they knocked me the fuck out. But like lately, my anxiety has been overcoming even my sleeping gummies that I stay awake through them. But I'm telling you, this is really good and their gummies actually taste addictive. Like if I didn't know that these were sleep gummies, I would eat all of it like it's candy. Even though I am tired, I know I do need the extra help. I'm gonna take my two gummies. This is crazy because this is going to be the last vlogmas. You're probably watching this before or after Christmas and I'm going to be posting more on TikTok so if you want to see me before vlogmas ends mainly then check out my TikTok for more videos. It was a nice run this year. I liked it. It was like my favorite and best productive time doing vlogmas. This is my third year in a row so far. I really hope you guys have healthy, happy holidays whether it's with your family, without your family, by yourself, with your partner, with your friends. That's it for the final vlogmas day 20th hope to see you guys in the next video bye